My name is uh, Rhys Scott uh, and I'm studying Level 4 Cookery. I decided to study cookery because um, I, I really enjoy it. Um, it's something I've had quite a passion for. I love food, I love fine dining. Um, I've worked in hospitality before as well uh, and it was actually an angle I was going to take when I was younger. Um, but uh, I didn't feel like sacrificing all my weekends and evenings, so I decided not to. And now as time's gone on, uh, I decided that uh, now was the time to do it. I'd been in the same role uh, in a, a sales manager role in tourism um, for the last 17 years. And even though I really enjoyed it, um, there was nothing new coming out. It was uh, pretty much same old, same old. And uh, I wasn't challenging myself and I wasn't really uh, looking forward to um, every day that I had in front of me. Um, so uh, I had a chat with my wife about it and uh, we decided that it was the right time to do it. So um, I took the plunge. The usual day will start at 8 a.m but you have to be here by 7.30 and your clothes all ready to go and you're with your equipment in the class so you can uh, start weighing up all your um, ingredients uh, and just be prepared and ready um, so that it makes the day go a little bit easier. Uh, then we do that for about four and a half hours and then we all have a big clean up at the end. I found it really good, it's been um, very educational. Um, it uh, has opened some opportunities for me I uh, have been offered a job as part of, or after my work placement, um, so that's really good to know that there's some um, possibilities there. And uh, I really don't think I would have um, had that opportunity had I not come, come here to Ara. I really like uh, each day we get up and there's, um, there's a new dish to be made. We're learning a new technique or we're recapping a technique that we might have learnt. And my favourite I have found um, is uh, pastry. Um, I'm quite good at it, I've found. That's where I've been getting my highest scores. So that's uh, making um, danishes and pastry and desserts and um, garnish and chocolate runouts and all that sort of thing. That seems to be my thing. Yeah, yeah. It's good to eat afterwards too. <laughs> I see myself uh, probably in five years' time, I'll, I'll be coming near the end of on the job training, I, I suppose you could say. Um, I'm definitely going to go and work for someone for a while and um, earn some money, uh, do some saving. Uh, and then I really would like to open something myself one day. Maybe not a bakery, but um, uh, a patissier where they um, have lots of beautiful eclairs and um, danishes and um, some bread rolls and things like that, but um, cakes and meringues and um, I've got a, got a couple of ideas actually, so watch this space. I work here part-time in the pantry, um, I'm part-time casual. It's what they are doing um, in the cafe here with uh, the meals that they produce and things like that. I think it's a good place to start. It's not the frontline service that you find in uh, normal really busy restaurants, but it sort of gives you that feel of finding your way around the kitchen and where things are. We make mayonnaise and mousse and um, sandwiches and it doesn't sound really exciting. A lot of it chopping and things like that, but um, you know, the more you can brush your skills up on that sort of thing, it makes your job a lot easier when it comes to doing all the plating and, and the service. As your viewers might see, I'm a little bit older. Um, <laughs> don't let that be a barrier, and uh, you can start something new at any age, pretty much. So um, don't be scared if you don't know what you want to do yet. Um, there's, uh, there's a long way to go in your life, but um, do what you want to do and what makes you happy. I used to travel a lot. So I was away for two weeks every month, uh, but now I'm home pretty much all the time, which is really nice, especially for my wife um, and for me, of course. Um, and uh, I just live a little bit healthier. I'm exercising more frequently. I'm uh, eating and cooking at home. I'm not um, eating on the road, which and staying in motels and things, which might sound good, but it becomes a bit of a drag after a while. So yeah, I definitely do feel that, um, uh, and people have told us we, we look happier, we look healthy, and um, it's been a win-win-win.